and welcome to the 12th day in this get more energy in 30 day challenge. We are in my home office, which is actually being uh, put in, into boxes right now because we are moving, like I said, in a form of video. Um, today's video, we are, we are actually talking about uh, removing energy drainers uh, in, this, uh, in this week. And the energy drainer that I want to talk about today is actually pain. And, you know, we all have had these excruciating pains, you know, like uh, if you break an arm or a finger or, you know, you're out running and you, you, uh, your foot uh, gets, uh, gets a spring or anything. Then it's not that kind of pain that I'm talking about and it's not, you know, no, it's psychological pain. It's actually those kind of pains that you don't pay much attention to. You know, like having a backache, you know that you have that backache, but you kind of ignore it. Or you're, you're having a headache that is not really strong, but, you know, it's there, but you just try to, you know, keep working and ignore it. And those kinds of pain actually drains more energy than you might think. Because every time your body signals pain, a lot of uh, in the nervous system uh, sends signals to your brain and uh, the brain is the organ in your body that takes up much energy and if it gets bombarded with these um, signals from your nervous system it's actually taking up a lot of uh, energy and your brain is is on uh, over <laughs> overdrive you know it's just um, trying to fix the problem so if you have some kind of pain in your body that you don't pay much attention to but that you know you might like me actually because i'm i'm moving all these boxes and putting everything in into the you know getting ready to move and i actually have a lower back pain that i've been having for like three weeks now and um i can i really notice it when i pack those boxes but it's like a pain that that it's not that imminent so i've just been ignoring it um, but but when I'm I'm sitting on my chair and having to and I should work, then I can feel that pain and it's kind of like, oh that pain again, you know. And and I rub it or you know put some I put a blanket on it to heat it up and try to fix it that way, but it's not really working. And it steals my concentration and and a lot of my um, mental energy. So I've actually uh, called my chiropractor today and got an appointment and. I, uh, I suggest that if you find you just sit and relax somewhere and try to feel your body, you know, do you have some kind of pain that you're just ignoring? Uh, maybe a headache, maybe a uh, lower back pain or whatever. And, you know, do yourself a favor and do something about it, like going to the chiropractor or drinking more water or, you know, in... in my cases, I, I really don't like taking medicine, but, you know, taking an aspirin can relieve you of that pain. But, you know, taking an aspirin is just like a cure for the symptom. It's not the, a cure for the, the root of the problem. So don't take an aspirin and, and just keep working. It's like, um, you know, uh, ignoring the pain and it, it's still the, the reason why it's there is still uh, in, your, in your system. So I really want you to, to try to remove the... The root of the problem um, but but in short term you can take an aspirin if if, if that's uh, if you're at work and you don't have <laughs> and you don't have time to go to chiropractor or whatever but try to remove any uh, root causes of pain in your in your system um, because it really is quite quite a uh, energy drainer and you don't think about it when you're when you're, you're used to having this pain but when it's gone you can feel the difference so i'll be going to the uh, chiropractor tomorrow to remove my lower back pain and then i hopefully will uh, ha have the energy to pack all these boxes without you know having to hurt on my in my back and so that was the tip for today and i'm looking forward to seeing you for another tip tomorrow bye for now